Hello and happy holidays. It's a little bit before Christmas and uh, ours specifically, but I'm um, just uh, hanging out at a buddy's thing, um, kind of writing as I go um, mentally more than anything, but just um, wanted to share some words with all those writers out there who uh, continually push themselves to push out good material and um, practice and perfect their craft. Um, yeah, published my debut uh, work this week. Um, pretty exciting. Um, everything's a win, you know. Um, got a big uprising in support, on on put of uh, support from like people that I've known for years, as well as new readers. Um, and I'm the thing that I'm kind of hung up on now is figuring out how to market the most because no one really knows, right? So um, one, I'm marketing my successes, um, which I found to be. Um, successful um even the unsuccessful ones but you know it's still early so i'm still figuring out but um i share that journey with people and it seems to to create interest and and some type of collective effort and and which they are responsible but i feel like the public a lot of the times that i'm sharing it with uh feel and i share it on all social media platforms whether it's facebook Instagram, Snapchat, I just share what I'm figuring out and discovering so that anybody who's interested or thinks it's not possible, whatever, um, kind of gets that too. Um, but one of the things that I found that was used um, resourceful was uh, Amazon's analytical platform. Um, I want to think it's their market center and it tells you things of like where your book's ranking and how's it going and you know there's good things and bad things with that for instance and sharing like oh wow like out of eight over eight million books amazon ranked me thirty four thousand four hundred seventy six great but that doesn't mean people should rest at that platform and accept that as we made it because no that you still want to be the best you still want to push more you still want to push the boundaries and try new things and um i'm doing that and figuring it out and you know it's it's great it's great um i love where i am i love where this book has brought me i love the things that it's taught me above all else and um the anticipation before everyone gets the book that's where it comes in and then not how to sustain it like figuring it out um so i'm at a buddy's place right now um just want to put some more content out because i think it's i don't know if i missed a week um it's been crazy like I said, just published the book three days ago, um, but it's good. And, you know, now I, I see my eyes wandering different places. For instance, I'm at my buddy's house and uh, just taking a break while everyone's inside. And um, my eyes went to the bookshelf. So what do I see at the bookshelf? David Mamet, the maestro himself. And it's a book I saw a while ago, but I thought I'd just open a couple pages. And then that started up another conversation at the party. Um, what's that? Why are you reading the book? Or not reading it, but just looking at it, you know? Um, not most, like necessarily being unsocial, but you know, um, yeah, it's cool, and um, it starts more conversations, and people get interested, and then you're building more friends and new followers, and just keep networking, and that's really what it's all about. Um, engage with readers, um, and one thing I love about my book is that it's for all readers. Like I said, uh, or I've told people, I don't know if I've shared it here on this platform, but whether you don't read or read or don't, you know, aren't comfortable in reading, I want to change the game i want to flip it on its head again and create something that isn't the standard for instance some of my stories range from a half a page to five pages and you don't have to start it at the beginning it's not a novel it's a collection so being that it's my debut piece of art um on this type of platform in the literary market like hopefully i get some people that normally wouldn't read or maybe you know in turn turn that into their journey and start writing stuff but i'm a big influence in in their journey you know who knows i don't know but um that's that thank you for your years your time and i uh, look forward to catching up with you soon all right happy holidays merry christmas happy kwanzaa happy hanukkah kind regards